Hello, hello, hello. This is Coach Kemi, CEO and founder of How to Think Global Consulting Empire. Thank you for joining me this Saturday afternoon. And I thought I would just share with you briefly via audio live stream um, why you need an executive coach in your corner. If you are female, black, Asian, minority, ethnic, and you aspire for senior positions up to CEO and or president level, then you need to listen to this live stream. And if you are um, listening to me for the first time, what I do is I teach female senior executives in the corporate space how to think to enable them move forward, to enable them achieve those senior level positions that they aspire for. So why do you need an executive coach in your corner? First of all, note the use of the word need and not want. You need it. You may not want it, but I promise you, you need it. I am a coach and I have coaches. So you can imagine uh, what that does for me. That enables me to help you better. Every coach needs a coach. And I think the way God made the world, he made it such that every child has a coach. The, the, the child's coach are his or her parents. You need someone saying, yes, you did that well. And someone saying, no, why don't you try something else? And someone rooting for you. And someone being there. That is critical. So let's look at the few reasons I've put down here as to why you need, not want, why you need an exec executive coach in your corner. Number one, your coach has your best at heart, not your money. Your coach has your best at heart, not your money. Let's talk about the money and your best at heart. Whatever you pay anyone for anything will never equal the value that you get from that person. The money you pay is not ever going to be equivalent to the value that you get. Ever. Ever. There is no amount of money you're going to pay uh, uh, someone who bakes bread and you buy the bread. That gives you nourishment, which goes way beyond the money you have paid for the loaf of bread. So when we talk about coaching, I mean, coaching comes from the word and from the idea of being coached, you know, football coaches and all those people. Um, they, they, you can't really pay for a football coach for what he does because he needs to think of strategies. Offensive strategies, not defensive strategies. He needs to think of every member of the team. He is the buffer between the team members and the owners of the, of the, of the team. The executive directors, the owners. That coach needs to juggle so many things. He is the coach and they have the goalkeeper's coach and the, and the physios and all kinds of people in that football club. The coach has to handle, as it were, all those little things here and there. How much do you pay him? You can't pay a coach or her. You cannot pay a coach what value they bring into uh, the lives of those football team members. Hi, Betty. Thank you for joining me. And happy birthday, Narias. I hope you had a good day. I think it was you. I'm not sure. Maybe it wasn't you. I'm not sure. So, um, your coach has your best at heart, not your money. If you are thinking before you hire a coach... Oh, well, uh, uh, how much am I going to pay them? Then your thoughts are stinking. I call them stink. I call it stinking thinking. That's not that, it, the value. <laughs> because when, when you finish with the coach, 
and you hire a coach for a year and you are done. Who you have become in that year and who you will be in the second year after the coach has left you is... You can't pay for that. You can't. Except you're going to pay the coach every single day. Every single month of every time you, 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 um, every time you have achieved something because of having, because you've had that coach in your life. So it was you, you were, oh, thank God. I, I, I'm sure you had a good day, Betty. So please, you need a coach. The coach is thinking about you. The coach has your best at heart. The coach can see what you don't see. The coach is lifting you up, not putting you down. The coach is saying, stretch more. The coach is saying, this is where we are going this month. The coach is saying, this is what you are achieving. And all you look at is, whoa, really? You are hearing inspiring stuff. That's what a coach does for you. A coach says, we can make this. And then, look, we can make it happen. You can't do anything about it. I promise you, you can't do anything about it except follow through with what the coach says and be grateful say wow look at what you've done one of my clients sent me a message only yesterday saying she has made her first million and she's into multi-level marketing she's not even into the corporate space and she said, based on what you taught me in the last three months, I think it was just three months, she worked with me in a group setting program for that matter. Um, not even one-to-one. -one. So can you imagine if she achieved that in a few months? Can you imagine what it would be like to work with your coach one-to-one? -one? So number one, the reason you need a coach in your corner is because your coach has your best at heart, not your money. Number two, the reason you need a coach in your corner is because your success is the coach's success. I mean, who wants to put their hands to something and it does not, you, it does not, it's not successful? Who wants to put their hands to a thing and it fails? So, and then we go, oh, yeah, 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 I worked with that person, but you know, yeah, I worked with that person for a year, 12 months. However, uh, she's still in the same position. She has not become a better person. No coach wants to say that. So it is in the coach's self-interest that you are successful. <laughs> it is because your success is his or her success. Remember that. So a good executive coach like me would work smart, hard, and offensively to ensure you achieve what you have set out to achieve. And in my case, to get to those senior positions. You see, getting to a senior position, getting those promotions is not hard. And it doesn't have to take long. It's really up to you. How you think about yourself. How you think about your purpose. Whether you know your purpose. And these are little extras I'm putting in here now. So I want you to remember this. That your success is the coach's success. Number three reason why you need an executive coach in your corner is your coach sees what you don't. That time and time and time. Hi, Lynn. Time and time and time and time again. I see. My coach sees what I don't see. My coach sees what I don't see. Your coach will always see what you don't see. Your coach will always... There is a gift. You see, coaches have gifts. Coaches... See what you don't see. We, you, you can be taught the rudiments of coaching. You can be taught uh, these are the skills you need in, as a coach. But I have found out that you can't teach me what I teach. Nobody could have taught me how to teach, how to think. No one. No one can teach Lean how to be a sales coach. No one can teach Dion how to work with senior women in leadership. It's... A lot of this stuff has come out of our lives. We have been in it firsthand. Mm -hmm. We have been there. Mm -hmm. We have touched it. We have experienced it. We have, we have gone there. We have been at the bottom of the barrel. It's not just, oh, I want to make money today. Let me just be a sales coach. No, 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 no. We've gone on some journeys.
And we know what it's like to be at the bottom of the barrel. We know what it's like to rise. We know what the journey is between the bottom of the barrel and the top. We know what it's like to be frustrated. We can describe it to you. We are feeling your pain. We know what it's like to be told, you know, no, you cannot make it to the top. We know, I, for example, I know what it's like to, because I'm black, I know what it's like to be looked at in a funky way and to be, to be missed for a promotion or because I'm great at what I do, I'm kind of put to one side. Lean knows what it's like to sell and sell and sell and not sell, <laughs> to talk and talk and talk and talk and, and not, I, I'm telling you, you need to listen to Lean. I, I don't think I've ever listened to a sales coach. I've listened to people say you have to have this one. But I've never ever listened to a sales coach. And what she teaches, you actually know, but you don't know. But she teaches it in such a way that you know. You now find out that you don't know what you've always known. And you did not know that it was serious. And you did not know it was pertinent to, to selling yourself. To selling yourself. There is a way you conduct yourself, you sit, you talk, you walk, you, you position yourself to even sell yourself at work for that promotion. So I'm, I'm listening to Lynn very closely. And you never know, I might need to, uh, to come in and share some things about how to sell yourself. I hope Lynn, you'll be on board if I need to call you up. So the, the third reason I said is the coach sees what you don't because the coach has been there. And guess what? If the coach hasn't been there, <laughs> she will go there so she can find out for you what you need to know so that you don't need to fall into any pits or ditches along the way that's the third reason why you need a coach or an executive coach in your corner because the coach sees what you don't and she can help you to avoid it or she can help you to enhance it to grab it to gr take a firm grip of it and run with it and the last um reason you need an ex executive coach the last of the four reasons i've written is the coach enables your innate strengths the coach enables your innate strengths i have found out oh thank you lynn see we got one in our corner already the you see a coach enables your innate strengths because we have strengths we kind of keep somewhere I would say, oh, I can't do it. I can never do it. I will never go there. You know, no, who told you that? And guess what? Your coach does not let go of your neck. She gets a firm grip of your neck and the, the hold gets tighter and tighter. <laughs> because we're telling you you're going to do this and you're going to be successful. We're telling you you're going to do this and you're going to be successful. You know, did I say it twice? Let me say it one more time. You are going to do this and you are going to be successful. We don't take no for an answer. Your co if you have a coach that takes no for an answer, you need to change your coach. Your coach does not take no for an answer. Uh, your coach does not say, well, you know, this is how it is. And I know how you are feeling. I know things are happening in the family. Pardon? Sorry, huh? Yeah, but what was that? We are moving forward. You see, when you're on the defensive, you are hiding and, and shielding yourself from being hurt. Mm. But when you're on the offensive, the other person needs to be on the defensive. We coaches, we're always on the offensive. We are not reactive. We are pro active we are not wait, trying to do it so that we avoid it we are doing it we don't try we are doing it so we can achieve it do you see the difference you see some of you want promotion but you are defending yourself from oh i don't want that ceo to see me i don't want my director to see me i don't want you know my peers to say and you're acting on the defensive you can't go forward being defensive you've got to go forward on the offensive go forward like david you know little david in the bible with the with the stone and the sling he ran towards goliath we your coach will show you how to run towards goliath just in case you didn't hear coach Kenny. <laughs> thank you lynn you are going to do this and you will be successful because nobody starts out to be unsuccessful to not achieve it to kind of double into it let's see if we, i i always say to my clients we don't i don't use that word try try presupposes did you hear that pre suppose like it supposes ahead of time before it actually happens that well just in case you fail you might fail at least you gave it a try we don't try we don't try we do i mean look at the 
difference try three letter word do two letter word think about the feelings that go through your body when you say i'm going to try and even the sound of your voice when you say oh i'll give it a try and you say i'm going to do it you don't know how, how it's going to work out you don't know if you'll be great at doing it but you do know you're going to do it that's all that matters because if you're going to try then you, you are bound to fail along the way or not give it a hundred percent or not come in with optimal on your th in your thinking we are going to make this happen it is going to work hey you might not get it tomorrow you might not get it in, in two weeks, but for real, as long as you keep doing, you're going to get it. It's going to happen. You are going to do this and be successful at it. You see, when we talk about successful people, nobody sits there and says, oh, it took them 15 years to be successful. All we're looking at is their success. The length of time it takes to get there is irrelevant. And people, I'm talking to myself right now. <laughs> the length of time it takes to get there is totally relevant. The important thing is you got there and now you are a role model. Now you are a statue. You, people can see. Mm, Kemi made it. All we can see is your success. Then if you come to us, we'll teach you the road, the process, the, the skills, and whatever we had to learn along the way. While we we're falling and standing, dropping and, you know, standing, uh, we'll teach that to you. So those are the four reasons why you need an executive coach in your corner or a coach. Number one reason, your coach has your best at heart, not your money. Get, don't get it twisted. You cannot pay for what a coach does. What do you want to do for that, that change in thinking or that five grand you know how to make every month with your sales coach? You're going to not make it every month. Are you going to pay her a percentage of it every month? No, you can't pay her for, for that tweak she has helped you to recognize and make and now you're making some good money. What, what? When you're earning over a hundred thousand pounds a year in your new position are you going to keep paying me that every 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 month <laughs> a bit of that every month no except of course i'm on a retainer you need a coach in your corner number two your success is the coach's success no coach starts to fail so the it's important to the coach that you're successful because that will show in on the coach the length of time it takes is irrelevant i really have to keep saying that to myself lynn because I don't know how I'll be able so long. But hey, it's how you think. Number three, the coach sees what you don't. And number four, the coach enables your innate strengths. Because sometimes we just sit back there and we don't use what's on the inside of us. Yet we have it. It just takes the coach saying, go and do this. And look at him. I have a five-minute mirror test. Go and look in the mirror and write about yourself. And you come and like, oh, everyone has ever done it. Oh my God, Kemi, I wrote this about me and I didn't know I had this. That's what a coach does helps you to bring forth and enables your innate strength so you can use it so i hope this serves you if you would like to know when i go live i go live every day at 2 p.m i do a video lives monday to friday um just like reminder reminder <laughs> glad it will be lean just like reminder in the comments that you would like me to um, get you on my list so that I can you can always know when I come on live and uh, I will definitely remind you so if you have not liked my page how to think with the number two please like my page please share this live stream I will really appreciate it because there are many people who need to hear this God bless you and thank you for joining me if you have any questions please put them in the comments I will be back to check what those questions are and to answer them. Bye.